Hello guys, welcome back to RPG World. Let's continue the playthrough for Dragon Age Origins. Uh, we just finished the Circle Tower. I think we need to do the Red Cliff Castle. It's time to do the castle. What the hell is the exit? Uh, yes, we take uh, Alistair, yes. Liliana, Indeed. and Morrigan. Indeed. And we go to Redcliffe Village first. Oh, of course, of course, a battle. Denerim. I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down from the Regency. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the Darkspawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a... a solution. With your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. Oh. Uh. An assassin. Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best, <laughs> And the most expensive. Just get it done. Okay. Okay. An assassin to kill me. Amazing. Of course. Off I go. On it. Let's go. Ah, a fellow traveler of the fair lands. Are you a seeker, perchance? My packs are light, but I have a tome of strange origin. The Deus V Eternus. Rumored to be the last message to a sinful world from the Maker himself. Hmm. Did you sell a few copies in the Circle Tower? I have uh, no idea what you're talking about, and uh, neither do these large men carrying swords. Get them! <laughs> okay. Oh! 
Stars. Cunning, hell regeneration in combat, amazing. Amazing. It is begun. Something else here. Uh, this cunning and how regeneration in combat. I think will be good for Liliana. Oh, restriction mage. Hmm. Mana regeneration. I think I will give to Morrigan this. Here, I have to deliver some quests. Then I will go in the castle to the passage from the windmill. Four. The deep dark before dawn's first light seems eternal. But know that the sun or Make us blessings upon you, Warden. I don't have any to deliver at the mage, I think. Or maybe in in the First village. Oh man, I think in the first village. Good to see you again. Yeah, in the first village. Mm, Lorian, or what's the name? Mm. 
<clears throat> we leave for now. We keep going. Where is the entrance here? Here you are. Here you are, boys. These... Things have unusual powers. Be wary. Hello? Is there someone out there? Who is it? By all that's holy, you! I you can't gay. believe it! You on? Maker's breath, how did you get here? I never thought I'd see you again of all people. So you are the mage Lady Isolde mentioned? You've spoken with her. Then you know I poisoned Al Eamon. For all I know, he's already dead. Oh my god. He's not dead. At least not yet. He's not? That's a relief. I can't tell you how much. Please, I know how it seems. Poisoning the Arl was a, a terrible thing. But I'm not behind everything else happening here, I swear! Before I say anything else, I need to ask you a question. You can do whatever you feel you need to afterward, but I need to know. What became of Lily? They didn't hurt her, did they? The thought that she might have paid for my crime. Uh... The Chantry sent her away. I don't know where. Oh, my poor Lily. She must hate me now, if she even lives. What have I done? So, here we are again, the two of us. What happens now? Are you responsible for what happened here? I... I know it looks suspicious, but I'm not responsible for the creatures and the killings in the castle. I was already imprisoned when all that began. At first, Lady Isolde came here with her men, demanding that I reverse what I'd done. I thought she meant my poisoning of the Arl. That's the first I heard about the walking corpses. She thought I'd summoned a demon to torment her family and destroy Redcliffe. She... had me tortured. There was nothing I could do or say that would appease her. So, they left me to rot. I don't know why, but I believe him. Why did you poison the Arl? I was instructed to by Terran Loghain. I was told that Arl Aemon was a threat to Ferelden, that if I dealt with him, Loghain would settle matters with the Circle. All I wanted was to be able to return. But he abandoned me here, didn't he? Everything's fallen apart. I never thought it would end like this. Maker, I've made so many mistakes. I've disappointed so many people. I wish I could go back and fix it. I just want to make everything right again. Why did you listen to Loghain, all people? Why wouldn't I? I was desperate, and this is Terran Loghain we're talking about for Andraste's sake. Why wouldn't I believe him? So, the Terran hired, hired you to poison our in Connor had started to show signs. Lady Isolde was terrified the Circle of Magi would take him away for training. Connor? A mage? I can't believe it. She sought an apostate, a mage outside the circle, to teach her son in secret so he could learn to hide his talent. Her husband had no idea.
Why is Zol be frightened of her son becoming a mage? Because he would be taken away forever. A mage cannot inherit a title, even the son of a powerful Arl. She's also a pious woman. Her son having magic was humiliating. Earl Emon had no idea of his son's abilities. No, she was adamant that he never find out. She said that he'd do the right thing, even if it meant losing their son, and that infuriated her. Mm -hmm. How much ma magic did you teach Kanar? Some, but he's still very young. He can barely cast a minor spell, never mind something more powerful. At least not intentionally. I have thought about it, and it's possible Connor could have inadvertently done something to tear open the veil. With the veil to the Fade torn, spirits and demons could infiltrate the castle. Powerful ones could kill and create those walking corpses. I see. I think I understand. The Arl's a decent man. I wondered how he could possibly be the threat Loghain said he was, but I did it anyway. I'm such a fool. Yes, you are. So, what do you intend to do about I'm it? I'm just sick of running away and hiding from what I've done. I'm going to try to fix it any way I can. We were friends once. I know I don't deserve to call you that after what I did. If it ever meant anything, please help me fix this. Man, I trust him. Why should I believe anything you say now? I'm still the same Jowan you knew. If... if you're still the same friend I once had, I'm hoping you'll help me do what I know is right. I say this boy could still be of use to us, but if not, then let him go. Why keep him prisoner here? Hey, hey, let's not forget he's a blood mage. You can't just set a blood mage free. Better to slay him. Better to punish him for his choices. Is this Alistair who speaks, or the Templar? I'd say it's common sense. We don't even know the whole story yet. He wishes to redeem himself. Doesn't everyone deserve that chance? Like yourself, you mean? Everyone deserves a chance to redeem themselves in the Maker's eyes. This man, no less than any. He's your friend. You know him best. Give me a chance, please. So how will you make things right? I... well, I tried to save anyone still up there. There must be something I can do. So, if I were to just let you go? I'd stay and try to help if I could. Perhaps I can help deal with whatever's been unleashed here. And after that, what happened? Afterwards? I assume I'll be arrested. Or executed. Or whatever people like me get. A part of me knew right from the beginning that I'd have to face the consequences one day. I knew I'd be caught, eventually. Everything I've done has just delayed the inevitable. I'm done with running and hiding. I need to account for what I've done. That's commendable, if it's true. I'm glad you think so. So what now? I'm letting you out of your cell. Don't try anything. You're letting me out? And what then? I don't care. You're on your own. No, I'm not leaving. I made a mistake and I'm going to find some way to fix it. I don't know if it's the right thing. Alistar is approved. Skill acquired.
I will not fail! There is no glory in bloodshed! Make up his... Very well. Hopefully you do not touch this more. Fully as you smell. So easy! I'll try to be merciful! It is begun. Here comes trouble! Cross Okay, I'm good. It shall be done. Brana. As you say. Uh, I still have space now. I can take everything. No. Not yet. It is begun. Passage the main floor. Uh, is that the way up? Very well. It is begun. Watch out! As you say. Uh, I want Liliana.
Hmm, okay, this is the way that I come from. I Allow shall do me. it. I could do that for you. Please. Ooh. Oh, come on, only shit. It is begun. I shall do it. Alisa, something here to equip this shield now. Now, nothing good. Nothing good, bro. It shall be done. A viridium mace. It'll be good to sell. Take a small fireball. here fighting with this one Hey Alisa level up That's good he will be a little bit Stronger. Hmm. 
here. Power power. Twenty six dexterity for your mastery. Let's take over power. <coughs> Oh really? It shall be done. There is no glory in bloodshed. I am your death. Now we get our hands dirty. No! If we must. Look Is the best. He's the best. Oops. Very well. You fought our head. Are you kidding me? Defend yourself! Ah. For the Grey Wardens! I never like this part! Ah. Right then! Are you kidding me? Let us end this! Holy moly! Wait a second, man. Morgan. Hmm. I need. She don't use electric.
Done. As you wish. That's not good. Just fucking dogs. I shall do it. Hmm. Cold resistance? Okay. Armor penetration and armor. I need to check my dog. It is begun. As you say. Injury kits are very important. Calm down, I'm, I'm not going to hurt you. I, I'm sorry. I'm so frightened. These monsters are everywhere. My my name's Valena. I know. The Arlesa's maid. I, is she all right? What happened to everyone? I know, your father. Me daughter. You yeah. know my father? Mm -hmm. I want to go back to the village. Is there a way out of here? Monsters! I'll find my way. I can run fast and I know the castle. Thank you. Welcome. Hope you survive. Have unusual powers. Be wary. There is no glory in bloodshed. Me again. It is <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with Alistair? Gets stuck most of the times. He's bugged as hell. Basement solar, courtyard, second floor.
Go to the basement. Let's go. Of course. Thank you. It is begun. Where is that exit? The courtyard. Uh, not yet. Very well. Ooh. Steel brassers, a gift. I uh, want to clear everything. Okay, oh, a chest here. How the hell I missed that? Uh, okay, second floor, courtyard. We clear here, but we go to the second floor. As you say. Oh, maybe we cannot. I shall. It's done. Key required. So I cannot go to the second floor. I need to use the. I need to use the basement cellar and to go to the courtyard, I suppose. Okay then. I can do that. It is begun. Do not, do not let them overwhelm us! Away with you! Very well. Hey, 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 help, help, help! Come and 
me. Get it. You manage here, guys. I will sow that group here. Don't give them the advantage. Ah, too easy. Bad day, huh? Ooh, not that easy. But was okay. This revenant. Fire crystal. Bonus of fire resistance. I shall do it. Injury kit, that's good. I can open the gate for that, guys. That's good. Something here? Hidden loot? No? Oh, that's bad. Where's my loot? Where's my hidden loot? No hidden loot. Landmark tree for my dog. Save the game. And hello guys. You have opened the gates. That is good. My men and I are eager to see our Arl again. Shall we enter the main hall together? It must be held if we are to regain control of the castle. As you wish, we will hold the gate and watch for anyone attempting to leave. Let me know if the situation changes. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I will take these guys with me. Let me see here if it's something. Uh, no. I don't know to take them with me. I should. Let's see if we can manage without them. I don't know. Maybe I can manage more experience, I suppose. Weird. <laughs> so these are our visitors. The ones you told me about, Mother. Y yes, Connor. And this is the one who defeated my soldiers. The ones I sent to reclaim my village. Yes. And now it's staring at me. What is it, Mother? I can't see it well enough. This is an elf, Connor. You... You've seen elves before. We have them here in the castle. Oh, I remember. I had their ears cut off and fed to the dogs. The dogs chew for hours. <laughs> Shall I send it to the kennels, mother? Connor, I beg you. Don't hurt anyone. M mother? What's happening? Where am I? Oh, thank the maker. Connor! Connor, can you hear me? Get away from me, fool woman! You are beginning to bore me! Grey Warden, please don't hurt my son. He is not responsible for what know, he does. I know, but what if he attack me?
So he's the evil force you spoke of. No! Don't say that! So, the boy has become an abomination and sundered the veil. Connor didn't mean to do this. It was that mage, the one who poisoned Demon. He started all this. He summoned this demon. Connor was just trying to help his father. And made a deal with the demon to do so? Foolish child. It was a fair deal. Father is alive, just as I wanted. Now it's my turn to sit on the throne and send out armies to conquer the world. Nobody tells me what to do anymore. Nobody tells him what to do. Nobody! <laughs> Quiet, Uncle! I warned you what would happen if you kept shouting, didn't I? Yes, I did. But let's keep things civil. This man will have the audience he seeks. Tell us, what have you come here for? Oh my god, I need to see all Imon. So you're a concerned well-wisher. Why didn't you say that in the first place? All this sneaking around and killing is so unnecessary. But father is so very ill. We really shouldn't disturb him. Isn't that right, mother? I... I don't think... Of course you don't! Ever since you sent the knights away, you do nothing but deprive me of my fun. Frankly, it's getting dull. I crave excitement and action. This man spoiled my sport by saving that stupid village, and now he'll repay me. Ah! Oh boy. Boy. Not exhaust our supplies. Another battle, I see. Man, I don't know what the hell is wrong with uh, Alex there, man. He, he, he cannot fight. Better now, I think. My mind is my own again. Blessed Andraste. I would never have forgiven myself had you died. Not after I brought you here. What a fool I am. Please. Connor's not responsible for this. There must be some way we can save him. I don't know. You knew about this all along. I... Yes. I didn't tell you because I believed we could help him. I still do. I'm sorry, my lady, but Connor has become an abomination. He's no longer your son. You! You did this to Connor! I didn't. I didn't summon any demon. I told you. Please, if you'll let me help. Help? You betrayed me! I brought you here to help my son, and in return you poisoned my husband? This is the mage you spoke of? Didn't you say he was in the dungeon? He was. I assumed the creatures had killed him by now. He must have been set free. That's right.
He's no more to blame than you are, Lady Isol. How dare you! If this man hadn't poisoned my husband, none of this would have happened. He should be executed. Your secrecy made his actions possible, Isold. But I... I know what you must think of me, my lady. I took advantage of your fear. I'm sorry. I never knew it would come to this. Well, I shan't turn away his help. Not yet. And if Connor is truly an abomination... He's not always the demon you saw. Connor is still inside him, and sometimes he breaks through. Please. I just want to protect him. Isn't that what started this? You hired the mage to teach Connor in secret, to protect him. If they discovered Connor had magic, then they'd take him away. I thought if he learned just enough to hide it, then... What are your options? I wouldn't normally suggest slaying a child, but he's an abomination. I'm not sure there's any choice. We can't kill a young boy, demon or no demon. Please don't say we're considering that. Connor is my nephew, but he is also possessed by a demon. Death would be merciful. There is another option, though I loathe offering it. A mage could confront the demon in the Fade without hurting Connor himself. What do you mean? Is the demon not within Connor? Not physically. The demon approached Connor in the Fade while he dreamt and controls him from I there. I need to go again to the we Fade. We can use the connection between them to find the demon. You can enter the Fade then? And kill the demon w without hurting my boy? No, but I can enable another mage to do so. It normally requires lyrium and, and several mages, but I have blood magic. Oh man, blood magic uses the life force of author as raw mana. Yes, that's right. The ritual I know, it requires life energy. A lot of it. All of it, in fact. So, someone must die? Someone must be sacrificed? Yes, and then we send another mage into the Fade. I can't enter because I'm doing the ritual. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. It's not much of an option. Is there no other method? The power has to come from somewhere, and that means either lyrium or blood. Then let it be my blood. I will be the sacrifice. What? Isolde, are you mad? Eamon would never allow this. Either someone kills my son to destroy that thing inside him, or I give my life so my son can live. To me, the answer is clear. Blood magic. How can more evil be of any help here? Two wrongs don't make a right. It does seem like a sensible choice, with a willing participant. Connor is blameless in this. He should not have to pay the price. You're the mage here, not I, my friend. It's you who would be going into the Fade. The decision is yours. Uh... There must be another way to enter the Fade. You can find Lyrium and more mages at the Circle of Magi, if they would even do it. The cycle tower is not far from here, and they can owe me. The tower is about a day's journey across the lake. You could attempt to get the Major's help. But what will happen here? Connor will not remain passive forever. I'll take that chance. Very well. I will keep Jowan here as a precaution. He says he wants to help, so he will keep an eye on Connor with us. Go to the tower quickly, then. The longer you are away, the greater the chances of disaster. I don't know, man. Very well. Uh, 
You know, I will deal with my decisions. It shall be done. Doesn't matter what's happened. is broken. It is begun. I shall do it. Ooh. Alistair Mother Amulet. Wow. That will be amazing for Alistair. Oh, fuck. I shall do it. As you Allow say. Me. I could do that for you. Please. On my way. A gift. Here I am.
Uh, okay, I think I'm going to the Circle of Magic. I shall do it. I don't know if it's the right decision. But honestly, I don't want to sacrifice her. Uh, you know? Ambush. I was sure. Oh, thank the Maker. We need help. They attacked the wagon. Please help us. Follow me. I'll take you to them. Hmm. <laughs> I don't trust that girl. Look at the smile. The assassin. Warden dies here. More. Okay. Oh, the dog remains here. Oh, that's bad. What's happened with me? Paralyzed. Oh, 
Okay, he's oh. alone. Oh, this should be good. Oh. Zevran, man, this guy. Wait a second, this guy. That's fun. This guy can be I a companion. <laughs> it is a fine thing we've done. He's not a companion. He's not dead. Kill him now. Wow. Wake him up and talk to him. Mm. Oh, what? I... Oh. Oh. I rather thought I would wake up dead. Or not wake up at all, as the case may be. But I see you haven't killed me yet. I have some questions. Ah, so I am to be interrogated. Let me save you some time. My name is Zevran. Zev to my friends. I am a member of the Antivan Crows, brought here for the sole purpose of slaying any surviving Grey Wardens, which I have failed at, sadly. Okay. Who hired you to kill us? I know, but... A rather taciturn fellow in the capital. Logan, I think his name was. Yes, that's it. Does that mean you are loyal to Logan? I have no idea what his issues are with you. The usual, I imagine. You threaten his power, yes? Beyond that, no, I am not loyal to him. I was contracted to perform a service. Uh, and now that you feel that that's... Gonna... Oh, well, that's between Loghain and the crows, and between the crows and myself. Why are you telling me I'll lose? <laughs> Why not? I wasn't paid for silence. Not that I offered it for sale, precisely. Uh, aren't you at least loyal to your employer? Loyalty is an interesting concept. If you wish, and you're done interrogating me, we can discuss it further. Make it quick. Well, here's the thing. I failed to kill you, so my life is forfeit. That's how it works. If you don't kill me, the crows will. Thing is, I like living. And you obviously are the sort to give the crows paws, so let me serve you instead. Can I expect the same amount of loyalty from you? I happen to be a very loyal person, up until the point where someone expects me to die for failing. That's not a fault, really, is it? I mean, unless you are the sort who would do the same thing, in which case I don't come very well recommended, I suppose. Fear. Uh, and what's to stop you from finishing the job later? To be completely honest, I was never given much of a choice regarding joining the Crows. They bought me on the slave market when I was a child. I think I paid my worth back to them plus tenfold. The only way out, however, is to sign up with someone they can't touch. Even if I did kill you now, they might just kill me on principle for failing the first time. Honestly, I'd rather take my chances with you. Won't they come after you? Possibly. I happen to know their wily ways, however. I can protect myself as well as you. Uh, not that you seem to need much help. And if not, well, it's not as if I had many alternatives to start with, is it? Okay. What do you want in return? Well, let's see. Being allowed to live would be nice, and would make me marginally more useful to you. And somewhere down the line, if you should decide that you no longer have need of me, then I go on my way. Until then, I am yours. Is that fair? Okay, very well. I accept your offer. What? You're taking the assassin with us now? Does that really seem like a good idea?
Don't worry about him. Hmm. All right. All right. I see your point. Still, if there was a sign we were desperate, I think it just knocked on the door and said hello. A fine plan. But I would examine your food and drink far more closely from now on, were I you. <laughs> That's excellent advice for anyone. Welcome, Zivran. Having an Antivan crow join us sounds like a fine plan. Oh, you are another companion to be, then? I wasn't aware such loveliness existed amongst adventurers, surely. Or maybe not. I hereby pledge my oath of loyalty to you until such a time as you choose to release me from it. I am your man, without reservation. This I swear. Okay, he's a pure rogue. Because I'm thinking to... Blast and damnation! Indeed. I'm uh, thinking to replace Liliana. But not now, when I'm going in camp. When I'm going in camp. Let's look now. It shall be done. Zevran appear here at all. As you say. Uh. Can I go there? Oh yeah. Very well. Metal shop. By the way, Morrigan level up. <clears throat> Magic. Sleep. Can we useful?
I want to use that slip. I want her to use the slip. Oh, I get one more companion. Oh, wait. My main level up as well, level 11. I don't know what I need to unlock. Blood magic. Oh, a level 14. Okay. I need cunning 16. Life ward. But... I want haste. Man, I don't know what the hell is wrong with uh, Alistair. Maybe because of fatigue. He cannot move. You need more dexterity. No longer suffer an attack penalty while using shield defense. Hmm. I want that. I need all the skills here in weapon and shield anyway. He's broken as hell by the way.
You really killed. I'm sure you need supplies after that. Uh, yeah, let me sell you some things, bro. Uh, this dagger I'll keep. The grease sword I'll keep. I don't know about. How the heck I uh, unlock that chest? I'm sure you can. I can have a, a storage chest in the camp. I remember that. You went above and beyond the call of duty for the Circle. You have done us proud. Can the Circle save a possessed child? The child is possessed. But killing the demon would mean killing the... Unless you intend to enter the Fade. Yes. Yes, it can be done with a group of mages. I shall gather what mages I can, and we shall leave promptly. A life is at stake. Thank you. My men have scouted. You are very thorough. I'm impressed. And I am thankful you arrived when you did. In no time. I shan't. Uh, okay, can I go back? Now? I think yes. Let me go in the camp a little bit. Check the death rogue. Maybe I can switch Liliana with him. Zebran. Assassin. Mark of Death. Oh shit. Don't have Deft hand. He's very good, man. He's very good, but he don't have deft hands. And I need that. I need Master poison making.
basically the Diana it's an archer a bar archer she's not a pure rogue but have that if I switch her I need that guy I need three level to be rank three on a... <clears throat> this lock picking which is a lot Mm. Minus one dexterity. Mm. I don't know. Man. Uh, Stan. Take the two hand that don't have a weapon and shield. Balance. Mm, yep. Mm, yep, yep, yep. I need to use Alice Thurman, but it's his bar as hell. Maybe because of uh, this fatigue. Maybe. I'm still using him. Oh, uh, wait. Black Remore to Morrigan. What? You found Flemeth's Grimoire? Yes. Ever since we discovered the condition of the Mage's Tower, I had wondered if it might be recoverable. But I had yet to speak of it to you. How fortunate that you found it on your own. You have my thanks. I will begin study of the tome immediately. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, I don't know. That seems like a steep reward to ask for. 
You could be right. Let us test the theory. Oh, Morrigan. There. Compensation requested and provided. I do not intend to squander this opportunity to learn more than Flemeth wished me to know. This should be interesting. I started the the romance with Morrigan. <laughs> uh, Alistair, you have this. This, this is my mother's amulet. It has yeah. to be. Why isn't it broken? Where did you find it? Um. the Red, Red Cliff Castle in the study. Oh, the Arl study? Then he must have found the amulet after I threw it at the wall. And he repaired it and kept it. I don't understand. Why would he do that? I don't know, but it's yours. Maybe he meant to give it back to you. Maybe he did. He might even have brought it with him one of those times he came to see me at the monastery. Not that I would have given him a chance, as belligerent as I was to him. Thank you. I mean it. I thought I'd lost this to my own stupidity. I'll need to talk to him about this if he recovers from his... When he recovers, that is. I wish I'd had this a long time ago. Did you remember me mentioning it? Wow. Huh. I'm more used to people not really listening when I go on about things. You're a friend. Of course I remember. I don't know what to say. I'm honored. Thanks again. Welcome, bro. I'm curious about Morrigan. Wait. 41. War. Liliana. 44. Why? Win. Seventeen. Mm. Interested. Thirty-eight and she's interested. And neutral with eleven zebra. Neutral. Meh, 16% I completed until now. Are you kidding me? Wow. 16%. A long way until completing, guys. We stop here this episode. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe if you enjoy the content. And see you next time.